Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to a game called Devolverland Expo. So this is basically like a marketing game that's made by Devolver Digital. They came out uh, a couple days ago. I will say about three or four. I just didn't get the route to streaming it. And I want to apologize. I know I said I was going to be back doing videos, but I had to take a break. Uh, apparently, we got hit with a massive heat wave here. I mean, like we were up into the uh, like hundred and tens for a few days there and we were no lower than 105 so i was running into some temperature problems with my pc in my room so i ordered some things that will be coming in so today is supposed to be the coolest day so we're gonna hope like hell it's gonna work but uh without further ado let's go to devolver land because i want to I don't know, I love Devolver. Like, Devolver has some published some really crazy games. Oh, we're, we're already here. Oh, whoa. Ooh, that's kind of slow. Welcome to the future. Show's canceled. Aw. All bags must be inspected. Okay. Use. Uh. Hey, Master Electrician. Hey, heck yeah. Make, make 2020 something to remember. Oh, yeah, it's been a remembering year. Exit. What's that say over there? Some <laughs> random stupid text. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. Of course, Devolver can make fun of themselves. That's great. Anything else I need to know? I wonder what's back over here. Does it say anything? Nope. Can we break the game? I want to break the game already. That's great. This is some stupid text. Some random stupid text. That's great. All right. Well, let's hop in. Hello. Oh, dude. Reception. Excuse me. I ordered some things from my room. Oh, okay. Oh, Shadow Warrior. Oh, I love that game. Oh, what's this? Okay, are we going to be playing some Serious Sam? Or is that about to explode on me? Oh, sweet. Some headphones. Nice. Oh, hi. Okay. Bye. What a cool friend. I did see some of the Devolver stuff, so I know this game kind of. It's basically a convention simulator. Marketing piece. I'm, I'm, I wasn't wrong. What else we got here? Uh, Blightbound. That's cool. Shadow Warrior. Weird. What is that? Oh, Ouija. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's see here. More than the North Fall. Okay. Serious Sam 4. Oh, I love the Serious Sam games. Okay. Have fun. Uh huh. Whoop whoop. Oh, this is dope. It really does suck that all the, uh, all the, uh, what's it called? What is this? Oh, this is today. The future is now. Sweet. I want it. Oh. No, nope, door's locked. Of course it has to be locked. But, um, it's kind of sad to see all the... Reminder, the convention center is now closed. Oh, okay. All, all the conventions have been shut down, which sucks. Ooh, t-shirt cannon. Heck yeah. Unleash the merch. That's the achievement I just got. Nice. Wonder. Can I just shoot? Boom. Oh. Boom. Roasted. Oh, okay. God, this is one of these games. I love them. But yeah. Like, we were... I was going to go to Comic-Con this year, but it all got canceled. And like, all my local conventions as well. Uh have been canceled as well. Find the security room. Well, I found the security room. I just want to hit him. Ah. What does it say? Staff only. Door's locked. Okay. Anything back here? Nope. Sorry. Later. Hello. Uh, security. Okay. So now I gotta find a way to get in there. What's this? Ah, grab your t-shirt around the corner. Thank you. 
Will do. T-shirt cannon. Yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to shoot T-shirts at everybody. That would be great. Okay, just gonna walk this way. I bet since I can't go in there, I bet that's locked. Better have to go this way into the darkness. Boom. Get wrecked. But yeah, Comic Con was supposed to be the one I was gonna go to this year. And then, like, I have co a few uh, local ones, but we all got shut down. It was, it was, it was a sad day. Okay, I need bolt coders. I have something I'm missing here. Oh, I was never. What does it say? We apologize for the lack of options in this area. <laughs> oh, Devolver, I know you're always loving to crack jokes at yourself. Bad. Bad touch. Okay. Ah. Uh. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. It says I'm supposed to go this way. Oh, maybe. Bad. Bad touch. Go away. I wonder, am I supposed to. Is this stuff that I'm supposed to do? Or is it something up there? Hmm. Hmm. Because that's, that's there. The door's locked. So. But I have a feeling we have to go up top. Oh, okay. Do I actually have to go on the complete other side? The complete other side. And oh, I died. Whoops. I was running away too fast. Ooh. That one's angry. Let's go into the speed of sound. Freaking okay, Sonic. Calm down there, bro. Oh, hey. Boom. Boom. Hmm. I'm trying to think of what was the last Devolver game I played. I think my last Devolver game oh, was. Actually, I don't know. Later, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Snuck past him. I showed him. All right. Oh no! What am I missing? Okay, there's something here I'm missing. I don't know what it is. It's got to be around here somewhere. It's like I, I have a feeling it's this. Wait, come on! I'm almost there. Just put your hands up. <laughs> Okay, makes no sense. All right, find the security room. Staff only. Security is that way. Oh. Do I have to shoot the button? Yes, I was supposed to. Back up. No, no. Okay, that makes complete sense. I completely missed that. That's great. All right, let's go. Hmm. Oh no. Didn't think so. Hey! I got I got my pass. Nice. Later, dude. That guy does not look happy, and I do not care. What is it? What do we got in here, by the way? Oh, this is I love this game. That's a Pika Niku game. That I played. That was so great. Golf. What else? Cricket through the ages? Okay. What else is in here? Anything cool? Anything fun? Jeez. Are you having fun there, bro? Okay, he went inside. Got it. But now I'm down here. Alright, time to go with the self howl. That yeah, it totally didn't take me about five or ten minutes just to get through that one part. Only because I didn't see the button. Hey, I'm an explorative type. What do you expect? Uh, it wasn't my fault. Is not permitted. Deviation will be punished. Oh. That's cool. Oh, sweet. Oh, RTX on, people. Uh, the carbon and wet's weird, too. All right. Well, 
I guess that will be what we do. Sweet! Oh, okay. Unannounced game? Oh, what was the unannounced game? I, uh, well, I guess it's unannounced. Can I hear? Oh, dude. It's the new Xbox Series X. Really, ooh woo. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let's see here. Okay, some place. What was that, by the way? I just heard somebody get killed. Or something was being eaten. Okay, well, so let's go check this out. What we got? Alright, well, I'm dead. Surprise! Oh, you are dead. I, I'll give you the power of a t-shirt cannon. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I, I don't want to use that just yet. I want to see what we got in here. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. Hello? We're... So this is carbon, right? This is what I saw? Oh, okay. Oh. Do we play as the monster or do we play as the the people? Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Later. Ooh. I guess we play as the I guess we play as the monster. Ow. Oh, he's gone. Wait, what? Oh, you can use the people. Whoa. Okay. So, yeah, we definitely are playing as the monster. Okay. That makes sense now. Carton. Carton. I'm probably saying that wrong. Oh, it comes out to the Switch, too. Hey, marketing objective complete. Become the monster. Okay. Well, I'll do that right now. We'll see. Guys, got. Any hey. Okay, one collective relic. Boom. That's crazy. That's cool, but crazy. What we got here? No line. All right, serious Sam. Right pad. Oh, come on. I didn't do anything, I swear. Yes, I'm a part of this attraction. I just, I just, I just, just wanted to find, go away. I will call your supervisor. Nope, I guess I'm not going through that way. I'm going over here. Oh, I got this. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna walk around. Maybe we'll find that those other uh, little things before too long. So. Hmm. That was actually a pretty cool game. Okay. Wait, is there anything in here? There's the headphones. Ooh, ooh. Chuck face. Got out of there like it was nobody's business. Okay. Well, I'm gonna walk around this way real quick. Oh, do I actually need to go that way? Whoops. Guys, we're gonna speed run the game. We're learning every nook and cranny to see if we can break it. We're gonna make this a 10 hour, this, we're gonna make this game a two hour experience. Who's with me? Well, not even that, we're gonna make this game uh, a one minute experience. It's like, just like take one step, ends the game. There you go. I love watching those type of games. When they completely break it to the point where uh, you can end the game in like five seconds. 
Okay, well, we're just gonna go this way. Go away. I oh, I can slide? You're being very rude, Saha, when I have to this way. Oh, come on, what? Security. It's very tight in this area. Not today. Whoa, but what was that? Oh, was that my t-shirt? Any, many, many, mo. Where is these collectibles? Nobody knows. Might wait for it. Wait for it. Good night. Yep. I love how the t-shirts just automatically, automatically shrink. Okay. Well, there's nothing there. Hey, we're here. Got anything delicious? Hey, what's this? Unannounced game three. There's like... I hit him! <laughs> well, I guess not. Come on. <laughs> oh, hello. So there's like three or five games that have not been announced. Which, they probably have already been technically announced. Hey, look, it's the exit. And I would love to show you a few examples now. Oh, okay. First, the simulation and sandbox nature of Weird West. The bulk of the team is composed of co-creators of... Okay, this here we go. This is Rafael Colantonio, creative director and president of Wolf Eye Studios. And Wolf I'm here Studios. today to tell you about our current game in development. Weird, Weird West. West. Okay. At its core, Weird West is an action RPG set in a fantasy reimagining of the Wild West. Okay. You play through the adventures of five heroes that have intertwined destinies on a quest to unveil one of the biggest mysteries of the Weird West. Oh. While we describe Weird West as an action RPG, some would actually refer to the game as an immersive sim. There are okay. many elements that set Weird West apart from any other action RPG out there, and I would love to show you a few examples now. Alright. First, the simulation and sandbox nature of Weird West. The bulk of the team is composed of co-creators of Dishonored and Prey, so simulation is like a religion to us. Oh, okay. It is in our DNA to let the players play their own way. Weird West is designed in a way that accommodates many play styles and many playthroughs. Whether you like combat That's actually pretty or cool. trickery or stealth or a mix of all of that, you'll enjoy experimenting <coughs> with the tools the game offers in a system rich and physically simulated world. Next, really got on fire. setting and visual direction. The setting is Weird West, you guessed it. It's an opportunity for us to explore a genre that has been kept underground, and we're excited about bringing our own take on it. As far as the visuals, we're going for a mix of 3D with hand-drawn textures and uncommon palettes that we think bring a unique style to the game. We want our world to be instantly recognizable and convey the mystery that is so important to the experience. It actually looks pretty dope. That might be a game I've now, on my list. Now, let's talk about how scripted versus how dynamic is the experience. Okay. While the game has a main quest, the events and the quests outside of the main path make use of what we call the conductor, which creates events and crafts a narrative that is specific to each playthrough. For example, oh. let's say you kill one of these merchants while the other one escapes. The survivor will throw a vendetta at you and chances are they'll ambush you later when you expect it the least. Oh. This participates to the feeling of a very tailored experience per player. Finally, one more thing I wanted to mention is that your actions are permanent in Weird West. 
While you may resurrect when killed, your companion won't resurrect if you did not have a chance to revive them on time. Oh no. And whatever choices you oh, made, I'm bad at those we'll type stay of games. in the game. So, stealing shops and killing people have consequences you cannot discard by coming back in time with a simple game reload. Oh, okay. We think it is a powerful it stops way to from doing safe to your actions and keep the tension high. That means you better be a good little boy or you better uh, own up to your actions. And that's about it for today. We have a few more surprises that I can't wait to talk <laughs> about, but we're keeping some of this for later. I hope you enjoyed what you saw. And please stay tuned for future news about Weird West. All right. Well, that was Weird West. Whoa. This is Rafael Colantonio, creative director and president. He went really fast. Hello. Okay, I gotta exit. Oh. But yeah, that's actually a fun game. The white. Uh. Hold up. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Oh, okay, that was weird. Didn't even know how I did that puzzle in the first place. All right, proceed to the next hall. Sweet. You defile this place with your presence. Your curiosity will end you. Of course it will. That doesn't surprise me. Thank you, friendly robot voice. Okay, is there anything in the bushes? Make sure you check the bushes. Uh, uh, I think they messed up right there, but protect, still check the bushes. Knowing Devolver Digital, they'll put it, anything anywhere. You gotta see those unannounced games. Joking, by the way. But I, I didn't really get to check out the full Devolver Digital conference. I have to go back and watch all of that. This will just help for a little bit. Dio. Oh, hey, there we go. All right. There's collectible number two of the first game. And down we go. Oh, boy. Okay, that door is locked. That door is locked. So now we're going to the you north. The oh, wait, are we playing Doom all of a sudden? Oh. It's crouching time. Or not. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. I think this is where I take my leave. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh, I hit it. I'm professional, I swear. Okay, I didn't even hit that one. Oh, come on. Throw it up. T-shirt. There we go. Go away. I don't want lasers. Hey, is that one of the things, or is that just a coffee thing? So you anything cool in there? It's cool artwork. I'll take it. Oh. You shall not pass. Okay, Lord of the Rings, calm down. We don't have time for this. Oh, <laughs> this is the credits. Ah, look at that. We already got the credits. We haven't even beat the game. Wait, have we beaten the game? Probably not. Of course that's locked. Oh, look at the moon. It's so beautiful. Password's 2020. Got it. So... Two. 
zero, two, two, zero. <laughs> yes, I am very intelligent when it comes to puzzles. Nope, not, nope, nope. I don't, I can't say that. If I'm gonna be brutally honest with you. Um. Okay. Because if you ever watched any of my other playthroughs, such as my Doom Eternal one, it had some puzzles in it. <laughs> nope. I can hear you scurrying like a rat. Oh, I'm sorry if you hear anything in the background. My family just got up and they're having a great time right now. So I do apologize. Okay. I bet we gotta go this way. Go to the sign that says Devolver. Ah, uh, yes, it's so great! Nice. Inspect the glove. I'll do that here in a second. There's so much other cool stuff here. Can I Oh, you missed a missed opportunity! Hey, look, there's book number two. Forge Titan's Might! What's this? I didn't actually read the name, so I have no idea. Behold, oh, this a is Blightbound. Okay. Dungeon crawler that tasks three heroes to venture down from their mountain refuge to Wait, is this a card game? Did I read that right? It says card game. A mysterious and corrupting fog that enshrouds the land. Ooh, so spooky. Each player will choose a hero from one of three classes. Oh no, it's not a card game. Someone said it was a card game. Let me at him. Or mage. My oh yes, mage. So lightning bolt. Terrifying horde of monstrous enemies and colossal bosses. Each class of hero fulfills a specific role on the team to overcome okay. mounting odds, solve clever puzzles, and synchronize their ultimate abilities to unleash massive damage. So lightning bolts. Battle through three distinct so, lands, my gameplay is with lightning bolt. <laughs> dungeons to conquer, including the eerie grave mark, the oppressive underhold, and the precarious blood ridge. Steal your blood nerves ridge. Okay. and prepare once again to enter the Blight Warrior. We are Lightbound. Noise. Coming July 29th. Oh, that's actually pretty soon. I might have to take a look in that. Bound by Blight. <laughs> okay, so what's this one over here? Okay, so we did get the book over here, right? I will expect that here in a minute. I will want to do this. Will you lead Faraday, master of the harpoon, save the castaways, and solve the mystery? The master of harpoon. Um, I would love to help out, but, uh, you know, I'm just walking around here. I'm like, I'm looking Skill for Kung Easter eggs. Studio from Kyoto, Japan, and okay. we invite you to take a, we are Skeleton Kuru Studio from Kyoto, Japan. Okay. And we invite you to take a sneak peek at the story, mechanics, and the challenges in your all new game, Oria. Oria? Olia is an action-adventure game that takes place in the land of Terraphage, a lost world home to forgotten creatures, vast ruins, deep caverns, and rainforest topped islands. I don't know about you, but I have like you this. You are Faraday, th a shipwreck captain. You follow like his this adventure one. to rescue his lost crewmen, leading them to a safe return to their homeland. Mm -hmm. Now, on his pursuit of salvation, Faraday is guided to an ancient harpoon of great power. Ooh. It awakens ancient enemies who slumbered in the depths of Terraphage. Well, now he just messed up. I'd like to introduce the world of Olir. Wild, dark, unpredictable as an ambient stream. Uh-huh. You will venture through many different islands on your search for a way out. Okay. You will travel through jungles and caverns, visit sites of old relic and I love these, like, like what, 16-bit, 8-bit games. And new opportunities for you I think they're always cool looking. To escape this shadowy land. Oh. Next, combat. Combat is at the forefront of Olea, with yeah. visceral systems that challenge the way you think about space. Okay. You can dash and teleport using the harpoon, 
and gonna be a ninja. immediately face hand-to-hand -hand combat with minions spawned from the darkness. Yay. Crafting and dunning magic hats give you additional power, oh, yes, including dashing and wall jumping. I want a top hat. Give me a top hat. And generating electricity. I have a top hat. We we'll have puzzles complement battle sequence by rethinking movement through a maze-like world. Okay. There are five major boss battles in Olea. Each one introduces a new character's story, as well as new combat mechanics. Okay. By mastering each attack system. You will take down these bosses and be handsomely rewarded with new areas to explore and new mechanics to unlock. Is that gold or rice? Uh. Oh. Oh, he did. Okay. Wasn't me, I swear. Leah is an experience we poured ourselves into. Will you lead Faraday, master the harpoon, save the castaways, and solve the mystery that surrounds Olia? Okay. That's pretty dope looking. What's over here, by the way? Oh, sweet. We're getting, we're very close. We're so close to, uh, whoop. We're so close to, uh, what's it called? All right, one second. I, gotta, I guess I gotta do this. Oh, I, I got busted. Busted! Oh. I got this. I got this. Get that out of the way. Alright, we're sneaking out of here. Dang it. What does this say? Uh, Mark II is here. Oh, are we going to get another one of these games? Power in the palm of your hands. Subscription required. God, no. I already have to pay $15. All right. Well, I guess we got to go. You will venture through me. Goodbye. Knocked out. Oh, come on. Give me that. Give me one of the guns. I'm serious, Sam. Okay, hold on. We gotta check to find the, um, the loss. Not there. Serious ham. Nope. Oh, dude, the minigun. Come on, the minigun. Okay, hold on. I'm coming, I'm not coming. Gimme, give gimme. Give Alright. Oh no. Here we go. When you hear I was an explorer. Yeah. Did you take an arrow to the knee? Sam Stone of the Surveyor. It was good. Hell. It was awesome. Yeah. I swear if you were gonna go with the whole I took an arrow to the knee. They don't care about who we used to be or what we wanted to do. But they thought this was gonna be easy. They came to the wrong fucking planet. <laughs> oh. oh, I miss Serious Sam. I kind of want to play through all the games again just because of this. I think my favorite was the first one, actually. That or two. Jesus. That TV keeps on getting louder and louder in there. I'm sorry if you guys hear it. I apologize. Oh, hello, big boy. Oh. Well, that just happened. Oh. Hey. A classic round. Hey, look. There's the little bag. It was good. It was good. It was all good. It was awesome. Hi guys. Boom. Ha ha. Ha ha. I hear there's some people over here. What are you? Are you trying to peep through the wall, peeping Tom? Easy there, buddy. There's no one there, unless you got bugged. Now that's pretty cool. I like the dragon. 
Whoa, look at the I want the bike. Give me that is pretty dope looking actually. What's this? Cosmo cover? Uh-huh. Oh, don't tell me hardcore parkour. Okay. Fine, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hello! Nice. Whee! Holy crud. What the hell is going on in here? We go from, we go from Serious Sam to this. I don't know what's more scarier. Hey, look. There's a get unannounced game two. Do I have all of them? I don't think I only had two. Okay, let's go check what it says. What is this one? I think this is that Battle Royale one. Yeah, this is the one I saw. Yeah, this is the Battle Royale one. This one actually looks pretty fun, though. That I might play. From 60 players down to one. Like, I heard there's, like, this, and then there's, like, a team-based version of it that they have. Oh, you're a wizard. I, it's like, I identify as a chicken, please. Oh, shit. The music's actually pretty interesting. You know what it reminds me? This music reminds me of Splatoon. Like Splatoon. That's what it reminds me of. Pre-order on Steam today. Get this exclusive outfit. Oh! It's... Oh, okay. Never mind. I realize what it is now. My bad. Stumble towards greatness. Oh, I want one. Thank you, friends. Okay. Well, that was that. Imagine if that was actually, uh, what's it called? Oh, we're sneaking around? Get wrecked! But, uh, got him. That was an actual expo, or, or like an actual booth at an expo. I would go there, just to slide down the slides. Oh, hello. Get wrecked! I'm in. This is Bravo 6, I'm in. Now, I actually do love the Shadow Warrior games. Uh, I have one. I've never played two, and I, I need to play two before I play three. But I think we're probably going to play through uh, one again. What does that say? Devolver Fanboy? <laughs> I got sneeze. Hold on. You okay. Sorry. I had to sneeze and it was going to be very loud. Okay. Alright. No idea. Oh, I didn't even press E. You know, I knew I wanted to watch this. Well, howdy, stranger. Hey, bud. Bang. Where are you? Can you hear me? Demons. They're trying to break through the gates. I'll track you down. <laughs> Later. Oh, okay. You know that secret was right there? Oh, sorry. That was probably loud. You know that sequence right there with uh, the, the gravel hook? It kind of reminds me of this ghost wider. Yep, he's on getting wilder. Oh, you're big. I think I just peed a little. Oh man, I think I just peed a little. Bing. Oh, I bet that had to hurt. Of course. Ooh. 
that was very nasty. Stay frosty. Stay frosty. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yes. Shadow Warrior Three. That's dope. Okay. Hey. Marketing guru. The glove of power has unlocked. Oh, sweet. It is my destiny to use the glove of power for good and not for evil. Okay, there's got to be a secret somewhere in here. Excuse me. Here, have a t-shirt. But, uh, have you seen... Uh, a little bit thing called an Easter egg or like a little collectible. I want the sword. Give me the sword. I can use that in my battle. Hey, look, I'm back. Hold on. Can I, can I see? Options. Is it my options? Nope. Hello. Let's see here. Ooh, that's just brutal right there. Mm -mm. So tasting good. All right, well, let's go. Oh, I could use the zip line. Hell yeah. Whee! <laughs> Did I just hit the go? Still, Devolver, you missed the best opportunity. I want to shoot the the can the uh t-shirt cannon and hit the bell and it goes dong. Nappy, excuse me. Nice. You Love the glove. Of oh, I just took the door off. Whoops. Uh, you can't make me pay for it. It wasn't my fault, I promise. Alright. Uh, bye, you're big. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. Yep. Hold on. Let me just give you a whole bunch of these. Oh no! You're giving them t-shirts just like you're giving me t-shirts. Wait. I got this. <laughs> <They'll> just laugh. <laughs> uh. oh, whoops. I just broke that. Whoopsie. Here, have a piece of brick. I don't even know if that works. Here, have another box. Owie. Ha ha ha. Pretty clever. I like it. Oh, dude. Is that a duffel bag? We. Sorry. Hello. Excuse me. Why are you stuck there? Yep. Got him. <laughs> it's pretty interesting. It's pretty nice for this. Is oh, hello. Oh, I got a camera. Okay. You can't force me to play that. Oh. Oh. Did I destroy it? Get the <laughs> get out of here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Excuse me, sir. Do you have any secrets? Here, have a camera. You can't make me pay, though. I didn't do anything. Wasn't me. I promise. Get the heck out of here. Hey. It 
Oh, okay. Nice. I bet if you got the other two games, they would be there. But all right. Well, I didn't get all the collectibles like I wanted. But that was a good like 56 odd minute little deal. That was actually pretty fun. That was more entertaining than I thought it would be. If I was going to be really honest. Oh. Yeah. But yeah, no, man. I, I think I think my uh, well, the game I'm really looking forward to is like. Or games so it would be Serious Sam and Shadow Warrior. That would be even the biggest ones. With that said, YouTube, I think this was a fun little game. And I hope you guys have been staying safe during these crazy times. And I will have more in the future. I have a VR horror game I am actually currently in the process of getting ready for up for YouTube. But until then. I will see you guys next time.